good morning and welcome back to another video. Today, I have to get the girls' Valentine baskets ready. So that is what I'm doing. There's Mark. Hi. <laughs> so they're not really Valentine baskets, however, they will use these in their rooms, in their closets, whatever. So it's not like there's no dual purpose. Don't you always make a purpose behind the basket? Yep. Right. So, I have to get some tape. I'll be right back. And if you're waiting on me to entertain you, you're hosed. I'm sure. I talk all the time. Just nobody ever listens. Cut this big tag off. Well, it's not. Yeah. It should probably expire. So. One at a time, though. Okay. And since these baskets are big, I'm gonna have to stuff them with bags at the bottom. <gasps> Did you rip it? The tag, yeah. For the sword. <gasps> There. There. Okay, so I put target bags in the bottom. <laughs> and then we need skewer sticks. Keep down. And then tissue paper. Okay. Now we need get cards I got. I got those at Best Buy. Mm. Oh, where's my scissors? Oh, no. You can open the candy. Alright, we're going to put our gift card on a stick. Like so. Sticker in the basket. First we have to put this in there. There. on the sticks.
All right, I'm done. This is all I could fit in the baskets. Ellie's, Emma's, and then I wrapped presents, and then one of Emma's present I can't wrap because the tissue paper is not big enough to cover. I know. The hearts aren't staying very well. That one. The other one seemed to be. So I might have to refix them before Valentine's, but the baskets are done. And these, raspberry and cream, pretty good. There was a leftover one, and I ate it. All right, well, we'll see if they're excited on Sunday. We are going to get lunch in 30 minutes. And then Ellie's going to youth group. Ooh, is she? Mm -hmm. So we need to eat dinner early. So we might as well eat lunch early. I have uh, hamburgs that we're going to make. So I'm going to make hamburgers on the grill so she can eat before she goes. Because she never eats. And then she comes home at 9 o'clock and has to eat dinner and goes to bed late. So She can get home last week at 9.30. Well, because they're making TikToks. Anyways. So, and then... Um, I don't know if I was going to youth group or not. So we'll see what they're doing when they get home from school. Bye. Hi guys, I'm home from school, excuse me. Um, so school today was pretty boring. Yeah, I had a Spanish test. That's the most important thing y'all need to know. I got really nice compliments from people. Everyone really liked my outfit. I had like this like floral cardigan on and even a teacher complimented my outfit. I was like, whoa there. <laughs> so anyways, my plan for today, I have really no set plans, but one, I'm gonna clean my room. Two, I am going to film a video, probably edit that today. Then I also have a study guide in history, first time in weeks, I actually have homework. And I have these Cornell notes um, that I have to do for AP Psych, but those are due tomorrow in like the morning. I already started them. There's like 50 vocab terms. I already have 20 done. So got that to do. And then, so uh, I really need to go to Target because I have to get a calculator because I have a quiz tomorrow. And this quiz actually like needs a calculator and I don't have one. I haven't had one like this whole entire school year and it's like really kicking my butt. And I always need like, a calculator and I usually use my phone but like that's considered cheating when you're taking a quiz or a test so I just really gotta go so I asked someone to go with me they haven't responded so I might just go by myself I don't know but um the person I might go with we might just do something after I don't really know but they I think they're taking a nap probably so anyway so I'm gonna clean my room and then get productive stuff done hi guys so um I got my calculator <laughs> I got a pink one, so here she is, pink calculator. So now I'm good for the test tomorrow, which is great because I really want to pass it because I have like a 90, so I need my A to go back up. Um, I'm exhausted. I got to go to bed. <laughs> um, so it's currently 11:52. Um, so I got so my person that I asked to go with me ended up going. So yeah, <laughs> but tomorrow's Friday and I'm literally so excited. You have no idea. Um, I don't, don't really know what I'm doing this weekend. Honestly, don't even know what I'm doing for Valentine's Day. Don't even think I'm doing anything, which kind of sucks. But yeah, I don't think I don't think we're doing anything actually. So um, yeah. The only major thing that I have like really going on tomorrow is my math test. Oh, and I have a history test as well. Ugh, why do I have so? And I have literally like, not even joking, like three different teachers like absent tomorrow. Like my first period teacher's absent. Um, my third period teacher's absent. Who else said that? I think. I don't know if my Spanish teacher said they'll be absent. I don't really know. Oh my gosh, guys. I also, um, like, selected my classes for next year. Like, reserved them. Like, 
was telling like the counselors like what I want to take next year. I can still change stuff, but um, I'm taking a lot of honors classes, no AP. Well, this isn't really your final selection, but I could honestly change anything. So I'm taking adva advanced math readiness. I think that's what it's called. I don't really know. Um, and then I'm taking honors economics and honors government that's like half both of them are half year so it's like one full course whatever so they're both honors i'm hoping that it's easy but i could have taken regular like i could have chose regular but i really need to take honors classes and plus it's my senior year so yeah um for science i did anatomy anatomy in physiology is that how you say it eight honors so four honors classes so far um for english just english four there's no like english four honors or anything i could take like ap literature but no no nope <laughs> um and then for my electives i did 2d art 2 i'm in one right now and there's literally no other electives to choose from and like i already finished like the spanish electives um, so I chose business and something business and whatever. And then the other one was like new tech and business. So like stuff to do with business because I think that's what I'm going to major in in college. So it just makes sense for me to take those classes now. Um, none of them are honors, but I might sign up for SCF, which is like a college, like a community college. Um that I could do and I could leave school early like after fourth period and I would take like two or three college classes and it counts towards high school and college credits so I might do that I don't really know I do really want to leave early senior year but that's like a whole nother discussion but anyways I just wanted to tell you guys like what classes that I might take next year because it's just like a 25 percent like start of your classes but anyways, I hope you all enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll see y'all very soon back with more videos. Bye, guys.